Hello, I'm Lisa, and today I'll get you through the process of setting up dedicated data center proxies. Let's get to it. After you've purchased your DDC IP addresses, you'll be asked to create a proxy user. So come up with secure credentials and click Create Proxy User. You should get a success message with a curl example, which you can use to test your newly purchased proxy IPs. Paste this example into your terminal or any other preferred setup. But before you hit enter, let's quickly overview the basic structure of a DDC curl request. Here's an example of a simple curl request. To connect to the proxy, you must indicate the endpoint, which is ddc.oxavs.io for DDC proxies. You also have to specify the port number like 8001. To authenticate the request, add your username and password separated by a colon. If you're using specific parameters, don't forget to include the user prefix. Finally, you may state where you'll send the request, which in this case is ip.oxlabs.io slash location. So now that this is a cleared up, hit enter. You should receive a DDC IP and the IP info. Note that if you repeat the request a few more times, you'll get the same IP. That's because you're using the same port. Let me show you how it works. Go to my products, find dedicated data center proxies and click on a proxy list. You should see your proxy list with information on the entry point, port, country, and IP. Notice that each IP is assigned to a different port number. So when you want to use a specific IP, you must indicate a corresponding port number. For more information, you can check out our documentation. And that's it. I hope this tutorial was useful. Thanks for watching and happy scraping.